Hey guys, Anthony from Freedom Factory here back again and this time we'll be exploring the App Store. If you haven't seen the first video about the Wallet app, you can go back and watch that first. But this time you can look over my shoulder and let's explore some of the apps on the device. Here we are back on the DGen 1 running EthOS v4. It's quite an upgraded experience having apps on the device from other makers. We didn't even have an app store before. Now you can download any web app or Android app running on our store and have your wallet instantly connect from the DGen 1. We work to bring an app store that works natively with your OS wallet. So when you click connect here, you see the DGen wallet pop up and connect almost instantly. You can, you can make really cool stuff happen with a root access wallet and it makes the whole experience just way smoother. So now you can play games like Cat Town and Friend Pet just by downloading, connecting, and earning in a few seconds. And since you interact with your wallet in the terminal, your gaming experience isn't broken up by signing a transaction unless you really choose to. So for example here, you'll see the DGen wallet and the options to connect. And signing doesn't take you out of the experience. It's just a message. I'll sign with my fingerprint. I think I hit it too many times. Perfect. And you're playing already. So on an app like Safe, for example, we've tried to make transactions decodable. You know, safe accounts and complex transactions need readability. And so we've tried to make that a priority for this hardware wallet slash mobile device. If we wanted to, we could go into one of our accounts. Let's see if we can create a new account for mainnet. And when you actually go to check out, you'll see that on the contract call, there's no asset transfers detected, but this will always pop up on safe when there is some human readable needed transaction. So you can always be sure what exactly you are signing. For now, we'll decline this one. The great part about having an OS level wallet on the DGen 1 is that if you don't even see the app you want to use on your DGen 1 in the App Store, you can actually just go to Firefox and do the exact same thing that you would in an app. So if we go to Uniswap, in Firefox, actually we've enabled Firefox so that it works the exact same way as the PWAs or apps that you would get from the App Store. Your wallet auto connects here and you can just start using the app as usual. If you don't see the app you want to use in the App Store, we have quite a list already from across the ecosystem, but let us know if you don't see your favorite app and we'll try to reach out and add them. For developers, just contact us if you'd like to get your app in the App Store. We're already working on a developer portal to make our app store decentralized eventually and we just have a manual approval process right now but of course we're happy to add you and make sure that your listing gets here on the app store thanks for learning about the app store with us this time and stay tuned for more videos about the other apps on the device soon thanks